Well, you know what? You because you're it's it's a weird thing that we we tell people what we think our worth is. So when you're when you're when you're you because I always say this when you first meet somebody, I don't know you and you don't know me. So how do I know what what you're worth? You you got to tell me what the price is. You got to tell me what this costs. Yeah. Yeah. And if and if I don't think it's worth something, I'm going ref- it, to it'll reflect the way the things that I say and everything that it'll do with it. That level of insecurity will reflect everything I do. And then you go, oh, you you don't you really don't think you shit. Yeah. And, and then you go, well, who knows better than you? I mean, you are you. So, you know, if you ain't shit. And yeah. so they tell you how to teach. And now, and now it's an odd thing, even with the with a, when a guy feels he's a approaching a girl that's more attractive than him mm-hmm. and, or at a different, you know, I mean, yeah. a level, I, or, you know, supposedly out of his league. Mm-hmm. The fact that he she doesn't know him, he has to tell her <clears throat> what his worth is. Uh, and and he does that in in his stance, in his walk, the cadence of his voice, the the the, the level of comfort, even even that like, you know, uh, relaxed vocal cords. Because mm-hmm. if you if you tense, you, you everything's tense. It, it, yeah. it, so it permeates everything that you do. So you're you're there's always this, this you're communicating and you're talking, but there's always this subtext. Yeah, there's this this subtext that's always swimming underneath it. That's what you got to learn to read. Yeah. And because, people go ahead. Go ahead. No, no, go. That, that's the honest place. They can't they don't even know it's swirling underneath. You know, go ahead. I'm sorry. And I think a lot of a lot of the confusion or insecurity would dissipate if more people would shoot. People don't shoot their shot. Like they're they're yeah. really they're worried that I'm not going to be enough. She's out of my league. He's out of my league. If everyone just shot their shot without worrying about being rejected, you know, you would you would realize there'd be way more STDs in the world. Well, yeah, but not all, oh. all something. They're all curable now, Andre. Some of them aren't. <laughs> The ones who aren't curable, you know, God bless you. I like the outlook is positive. Yeah, I'm always positive <laughs> because people are too worried what everybody else thinks. You yeah, know, that's a fact. you know how many like I've had boyfriends where I know nobody said this to me, but I've had guys in my life where I can tell girlfriends or whatever are like in their head. They're kind of like, how in the hell yeah. you get him? And right. I'm like, because I I shot my shot I, or he shot his shot. And we're like, yo, what for people? Yeah, that's all, that's all that matters. You know, also, and if you and you know, if you if you put your feet on the ground every day and your your intention is to be kind and loyal and credible, that is more valuable than anything. It's like, you know, it's like when you talk like we were talking about Ty, Ty is one of those dudes. And so that current that's currency that we that we take for granted. You know, if somebody trusts you, it's because you're trustworthy. Mm-hmm. You've already earned their trust. This is this is not an ass- they've already made that assessment in the first place. So yeah. everything that you do is congruent with that with with being trustworthy. Yeah. Same thing is is the case with value or 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 sex appeal or or confidence or what you think you deserve. You man score 202. Better hear what I've got to say because you won't get it again. I'm not an alpha male. I'm not a beta male either. I'm just a better man. Better man. Put your happiness first, because if you don't, they won't.